Hey guys, today I am here with another video on operations on rational numbers. I know I have been making videos on rational numbers from very long back. I have made many videos till now, around 5 to 6 videos. I think you guys are bored, but don't worry, this is going to be the last video on the topic of rational numbers. From the next video, we are going to another chapter, and if you have not seen the previous videos in this playlist the description the link of the playlist is in the description box below click on the link go back to the previous videos and revise all the videos so that you will be very clear about the topic of rational numbers okay this is going to be a very short video because i hope you guys all are familiar with the operations like addition subtraction multiplication division so that is the reason why i have taken only one example for each operation and i'm going to wind it up soon okay uh, and you, ha you have addition first going on to the addition in order to add two rational numbers you have to first make the denominator same you have to first make the denominators equal and then you have to add the numerators okay so for this you're going to, uh, to in order to make the denominators equal as I already said you in the previous video of comparison of rational numbers you have to take the LCM of the denominators first. So first you're going to find the LCM of denominators, LCM of 5 comma 12 and that is going to be 60. Okay. Let us go with 19 by 5. 19 by 5, you have to multiply with 12 in order to make 5 as 60, right? So the same 12 you have to multiply for 19 also. 19 into 12 will give you 228. Okay, 228 by 60 and uh, another fraction you have is 18 by 12 but 12 you are going to multiply with 5 in order to get 60 so the same 5 is to be multiplied to 18 also then you are going to get it as 90 by 60 yes 220 by 60 and 90 by 60 when you add both of them 228 and 90 you can add them directly because the denominators are same the denominator is 60 so you can add them directly that will be equal to 228 plus 90 by 60 that will be simply equal to 318 by 60 you can still simplify this 318 by 60 because this is divisible in three table uh, but it is your wish it is not mandatory that you have to simplify it it is up to you you can simplify it or you can keep it as, as it is okay this is about addition of rational number for addition there is nothing you have to do you have to first make the denominator same denominators can be made same by taking the lcm of the denominators okay the next is about subtraction so moving on to the subtraction you have 6 by 5 and 2 by 15 with the subtraction also you have to follow the same process that you have done for addition but the only thing that you have to do here is you have to subtract the numerators not add it okay for that you're going to first take the lcm of denominators 5 comma 15 LCM of 5 comma 15 is 15. You already know that. If you don't know how to find the LCM, mention it in the comments. I'll make a video on finding the LCM also. Okay. Okay. The LCM is 15 and 6 by 5. So you're multiplying with the 3 in order to get 15. So for the numerator also, you're multiplying with the same 3. You'll be getting 18 by 15. Okay. Next. 2 by 15. For 2 by 15, 15 you are multiplying only 1 in order to get 15 so for 2 also you have to multiply the same one that will be equal to 2 by 15 so now you are going to subtract 18 by 15 and 2 by 15 18 minus 2 will be equal to 17 by 15 so the answer is 17 by 15 6 by 5 minus 2 by 15 is nothing but 17 by 15 first you have to make the denominator same the same process you followed for addition you can follow that process for here also okay the next multiplication and when coming to multiplication there is no uh, mandatory there is nothing mandatory that you have to check that the denominators are same or the numerators are same nothing you can directly multiply numerator with numerator and denominator with denominator you can directly do that so when you multiply 7 into 7 by 8 into 9 by 5 the only thing that you have to do is you have to multiply 7 and 9 you will be getting 63 by 40 that's it okay this is multiplication is very simple you can just simply multiply the numerators multiply the denominators and write the value if you can cancel if you can simplify this more you can simplify or else you can leave it like that that is up to you in the question if you are asked to simplify then you have to write the more simplified form 
okay you may get another doubt if we are given decimals how to multiply two decimals 1.5 into 0.3 is your question how to multiply these two decimals then you have to simply multiply forget the decimals first if you forget the decimals you will be getting 15 into 3 right so first multiply this 15 into 3 15 into 3 is 45 write the same 45 here okay how many points you having here one point and here one point one point is nothing but after decimal point how many digits you are having here you have only one digit here also you have only one digit total one plus one is two okay one plus one is two so you have to put your point here it will be 0 0.45 simply very simple okay that is about multiplication and the next is division coming to division how do you do division 12 by 7 divided by 48 by 3 but when you are asked to divide you have to write its reciprocal and you have to multiply it okay simple process into you have to make this divided by sign as multiplication sign and when you change this division sign into multiplication sign you have to write its reciprocal that means 3 by 48 okay this will be ones are and fours 12 ones 12 12 fours are 48 so you can simply sim cancel it and you can write it as 7 into 4 is 28 and that will be equal to 3 by 28 okay for division simple you have to first change the division sign into multiplication sign and then you have to do the reciprocal simple okay this is all that's all for this video and the workout question you have for this video is take a screenshot of the questions okay the first one is 16 by 9 plus 25 by 16 and 3 by 8 minus 17 by 6 try to solve these questions and mention your answer in the comments i'll tell whether it is correct or wrong and guys if you have not yet subscribed to my channel do subscribe share with your friends and do like this video if you have any suggestions or if you want me to include any other topics do mention them in the comment section below okay thank you for watching this video guys